Okay, so I got my Amazon box in. I got my Amazon in. And I thought I would show some of it to you guys. Now, this is my 24 pack of fittings. And it looks busted right there in the corner. One of the things that I read on the review was that the guy only got 20 fittings instead of 24. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 20, 21, are you serious? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19? Only got 19 out of 24 fittings. Are you are you serious? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 20. You fuck with me? Look at that. 24 piece. And they only gave me 20? That's bullshit. Alright, so don't effing buy that kit. Here, I'm going to show you all it too. Just so you guys know what kit I'm talking about. That way, you don't make the same damn mistake I did. So, where is it at? Right there. Yeah, that kit. See? It even says it. 24 piece. I got all of that, but I didn't get those. I give it one star. One star ratings, what you get, you lying bastards. Alright, so let's see what else. Oh, my solid state drive showed up. Yay. I read some really good reviews out of... It had like 81 five-star reviews. Um, so, and it didn't have... It only had like three one-star reviews, but the people that were using it, I think, were idiots because I read the reviews and it sounded like they were morons. So, yeah, we were going to use that. That's going to be a lot of fun. What else we got in here? Our flow meter. That's cool. Very cool. Been waiting on this thing to show up. Let's see here. See, it's blue on one side and red on the other. <laughs> We're definitely going to use the blue side. Looks like it needs to be cleaned out a little. Alright, good deal. Well, at least that's what it says it is and then I got these these are made of aluminum these are for air but they're G14 thread and they're hollow so you could actually use this for water cooling if you wanted to as a riser which was my idea hmm okay set that to the side Oh, this is the display. Very nice. Computer system. So that way you could run certain things. That That's going to add a nice touch to our case. Set that to the side. Last but not least is this box. Let's see what's in it. I got my knife with me. Yes, I do. Huh. It's my five pack of green fans. These are different. These are by up here, but yet they have a different emblem on it. That's funny. I swear it's always funny when you buy when you buy like generic brands and stuff and what you actually get in the mail versus what they show you on the picture when you go to buy it. Huh. Uh well let's let's at least see if these are green. Well good, they got something else right. They actually sent me green fans. These aren't as bright as the other ones, I don't think. But they're green halo fans and that's exactly what they are, and they're the identical brand. To the ones I already bought, supposedly. So, alright, well, good enough for me. 3.5 inch LCD screen. 
this little baby is uh, actually it's pretty cool because it comes with a case and everything um, it's from a company called Samarza and it's the TFT touchscreen Raspberry Pi TFT LCD screen monitor with protective case for the Raspberry Pi uh, Raspberry Pi 3 model B plus and all Raspberry Pi systems it has video, movie play, arcade game, HDMI, audio, output, blah, 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 blah. So, first thing I notice is this thing for the touch screen. That's kind of cool. So that way you can, like, poke stuff with it. Touch the screen. Get it? What's in this thing? What's this right here? Let's see if I can get that out. Or maybe that's why they included this thing. So you can dig the parts out of the phone. If I can get it out. Okay, so that is an HDMI to HDMI adapter that goes into the side. This piece goes in your Raspberry Pi and the other part goes into the screen. That way you don't have like this long cable. That's pretty cool. Okay, moving on. So in the kit, and get a little screwdriver that's pretty cool um, heat sinks that's really cool that's probably for the pie I'm not sure uh, I'm probably gonna put them on the TV on the screen and then you get a kit uh, this is a plastic acrylic It's like a frosted. I wonder if that's a layer that can get removed. I hope so, because I don't like that frosted look. Hopefully that's just a film. If I just read this, I would know, because it says peel. Um, that's what it's supposed to look like. Mm. Okay, so anyway, the uh, I'm actually not going to use this for a Raspberry Pi. I don't actually own one. Um, what's on the other side? Nothing. I don't want to break it. So I'm going to push it out from the bottom. Oh yeah. Okay, so it's the MPI 3508 board. It's 480 times 320. Uh, you can see there it has the HDMI, even has an audio 3.5 jack and on off switch and then power and it does have some chips on the back right there that's probably the controller that's probably what we'll put a heat sink on if we can the actual board is pretty thick and heavy has a good little weight to it um, but I'm going to use it for a side screen in one of my computers that we're working on so it would look like that and it would display something I almost don't know if I what is that a small standard I might be able to hook this thing up let me check it out real fast see if I can hook it up okay so I plugged it in and I'm not getting any signal out of it. Let's see here, it might be because I'm messing with it. It does come with some software and stuff. Um, I guess when I put it in the case, I'll be able to deal with it. I don't know, is that the power button? How's the brightness? Huh, there's a brightness leveler on it. I wonder why it's not working. I got it hooked up to the computer. Theoretically, it should work, but it might be registering as a different source so okay I, I don't have time to fool with it I just kind of wanted to see if it would come on just by plug and play 
um, it actually claims to be a plug and play operation um, it actually says it right there plug and play with fun so uh, it might be an issue on my part maybe because when I plugged when I went from that size panel to that size panel the computer got confused and maybe didn't recognize it so but like I said it came it comes with uh, a driver disc somewhere where is that at here see see it comes with drivers so included drivers so that makes me think that if you're going to use it for your system you gotta put drivers in it which makes sense so okie dokie oh, it even has a QR code to scan so anyway 3.5 inch just thought I'd show you guys it alright so oh, that was that was every that was all of it the, the BS fitting kit that I got and flow meter I hope this works <laughs> and these fittings and the touch screen so a couple more improvements have shown up I'm waiting for the water cooling kit and the rest of the stuff to show up so I can complete the build so all right guys I just wanted to show y'all what was in the Amazon box